Good day guys, this is Kimmerman from Kimmerman Studio and today we will check one of the important equipment of a medic, the ER bag or the emergency response bag. Or what we also call the Thomas pack. So Thomas pack has a five outer pouches or outer pockets this one the pocket one pocket two pocket three four and five and the internal pouches which we will see later on and we will check them one by one so we have here a guide, a list that uh, serves as a checklist also to check if it is complete or not complete. Okay, we'll start with the pouch one. This is the pouch one where you can see the The BP cup, your stethoscope, shears, and flashlight or pen light. This flashlight and or sometimes pen light, but I have my pen light also in my pocket. You should be put here. In the pouch one, okay? Pouch one. Check. Pocket two here. Pocket 2 consists of uh, easy bandages, triangular bandages, and boss squares. So, this is it. So, here you can see the bandages, triangular bandages. The first one is elastic bandages. Again, elastic bandages. Your gauze squares here. Here's your gauze squares. Also, some elastic bandages. So it's complete. should be checking this from time to time because this will be your partner when you respond to a patient so this should be complete always pocket 3 this is the pocket 3 where you can see the abdominal pack or trauma packs here yes So these are your multi-trauma packs and abdominal packs or tender sac. So it's complete. You need to check this systematically to avoid confusion. You need to check it chronologically. Pocket 1, Pocket 2, Pocket 3, and now we are going to Pocket 4, this is the Pocket 4, where you can see the yellow hazardous materials bag, this one, the general waste bags, this one, sharps container, anything that is uh, puncture proof, plastic, 
and your wax paper bag where your patient can vomit. And last is the pocket five. Pocket five consists of goggles. Gloves, sheets, or the rescue blanket, plastic aprons, pens, sets of forms, and triage tags. So it's complete. Perfect. So the outer pockets are all complete. Now we're going to the internal compartments of the bag. So we will open this. This is what you will see. These are the pouches. And another pouches. This is the pouch one. Pouch 2, pouch 3, 4, 5, IV compartments, and your medicines. So the internal frame of the bag consists of splints. These are the wire splints. Added splints, and some younger suction for your suction machine. So we go in the pouch one first. Pouch one consists of non-adhesive dressing, tender sat, micropore, and sink tape. So these are your dressings, non-adherent dressings your tender sats micropore and zinc paint or zinc plaster pouch 2 consists of polydon iodine Antimicrobial cream and ice patch. So it's complete. So pouch 3 consists of your airway apparatuses, the nasal cannula, simple face mask, nebulizer mask, and manual breather mask, and some suction catheter. It's complete. Should be familiarized, or you should be familiar with the items inside. So, whenever there is a response, you are well known by your equipment. Pouch 4 consists of this is the pouch 4. OPA or the Porphyridone Gel Airways Adjuncts, the basic adjuncts. Mm -hmm. 
Not much of holder. This is your CO2 detector. Ambu bag mask. The ambu bag. Five. This is pouch five. In pouch five. There is also a set of mask, another breather, nasal cannula, your nebulizer mask, and simple face mask. Also, one suction catheter. It's complete. So these are your airway equipments. Sometimes this takes a uh, hard time to close because of the air from the plastics. Make sure you fit them properly inside. That's good. Good to go. Okay. Now we're going to the IV compartments. There are three IV compartments here. One, two, and three. So in one, let's check this IV compartment. One, it says here there is okay, so remove this. We have here your normal saline. One liter normal saline. Have your ID set, gloves, bandages, and your ID preparation kits, alcohol swabs, bandages, gloss, and tegaderm. So let's put this here. Outside this pouch, there is one micropore and your IV cannula, sex of IV cannulas here. So these are your IV cannulas. So there's gauge 20 Gray gauge 18, green gauge 
I'm sorry. The green gauge 18. Gray is gauge 16. And this one, gauge 14, the orange one. Okay. Good. It's complete. Not expired. So, put this back again here. So, IB3, uh, pouch 3, also the same. And this, both normal salines. So, yeah, one look has the same components. IV2 pouch looks like this is the lactated ringer solution same components ok complete there is one penrose drain as a tourniquet as your tourniquet there are also gauges here panulas ok and that's it. Infu uh, pressure infuser. Your uh, LMA laryngeal, laryngeal mask airway. Yes. Okay, complete. Now we will go to the medicines. Now we're here in the yellow compartment, which is your medicine bag. So here you, you will see emergency drugs such as atrophin sulfate, this one, epinephrine, three, ampules, epinephrine, yes, your pain reliever, pain, uh, pain reliever in uh, ampule also, your amiodarone, Three vials. Needles. Needles. Syringes. Alcohol preps. You have here 10 cc syringe. Insulin syringe. Not expired. Yes. Yeah. Twenty cc syringe, not expired. Five cc syringe. Not expired. Your blue wagon injection for hypoglycemia BP injections BP water injections your sodium chloride 10 cc ampule your adrenaline injections this is a uh, one is to ten thousand. Same. One is to ten thousand here. I don't have here the epipen. We have here the salbutamol, nitroglycerin, and chewable aspirin. Three hundred milligrams. So let's check in the list. Okay, complete. Everything is to follow. Just requested for it.
So let's close it. Use it now. And I'm confident that my bag is complete. On the outside, we have the cervical collar. Rigid cervical collar. Here. Okay, thank you for watching, and I hope you learn a lot in uh, checking in the Thomas Pack or the ERB Emergency Response Bag. Please, uh, if you like this video, give me a thumbs up, like, and subscribe to my channel. This is Kimmerman from Kimmerman Studio saying, Take care, God bless, and keep safe. Bye.